This is Code.org. I'm working on CS Principles, Unit 5, Building Apps, Lesson 10, Building an App, Color Sleuth, Part 4. You try it. You set property. Time to get coding. This is the starting point for a whole new project. Awesome. We've started you out with all the UI, which is user interface elements in place. You'll work with the design and the layout now. We've also started you out with some code that sets the color of one of the buttons. I think this is what they mean. You set property three more times to set the color for the other three buttons. So all four are orange. We've chosen an orange color. That, okay. For now, but the... But this will change later. I bet we randomize it. Oh, okay, and this icon appears that means that this level is part of a larger project. Changes will be saved across the levels. Cool. So we're going to slowly build a app. All right. So set property three more times. Set property one more time, set property two more times, set property three more times. And our orange. Do they want it to be? Oh, yeah, we got it. Okay. So button two, button three, button four. And. The button's background property, right, is what we want, the background color. These are all the buttons, one, two, three, four. And uh, we're going to set it so we declare this variable color and set it equal to the RGB color of this. And so we're going to set all of them equal to our variable color. So we just need to type that in. And remember, you can't have quotes around a variable name. Otherwise, it will think it's a string, and it's not a, well, it's a variable. I wonder. All right, and let's test it out. But uh orange. Is that awesome? I'm excited to see what this app is like. Let's keep uh, going. 